Now inside of this bag, I have a product that I've received a lot of requests to review. So today, I'm getting to it. My name is Luke, this is the Outdoor Gear Review, and this is the Soto Field Hopper Mini Pop-Up Table. Let's get to it. This is the storage bag that comes with the Field Hopper. Draw pull at the top, opens up like so. Now this is a windscreen. I will come back to that in just a minute. This is the table. Now check that out. Very small form factor. It folds up. Now this is what I refer to as a book table. Why do I say that? Because it opens up like a book and it closes like a book. When it's closed, this is 11.7 inches long. 4.3 inches wide and you're looking at a width of 0.7 inches so it's just a little bit more than half an inch when it's unfolded 11.7 inches 8.3 inches and it has a height of 3.1 inches the top is aluminum the legs the hardware that's all stainless steel the storage bag is made from nylon when it comes to the weight for this table, you're looking at 14.1 ounces. So it's lightweight, yes, but it's not ultra light. For an ultra light backpacker, this probably isn't something that they would carry anyways. But for those who are looking for a table of sorts, which they could use for a wide range of purposes, this is an interesting option to consider. I've been testing this out for numerous months now and I like it quite a bit, I really do. This is a product that so many of you all have asked about that I decided to go ahead, get the review done because all in all, this is a pretty slick product. This is made by Soto, which is a Japanese company. I've been testing out lots of their products which I've purchased with my own money. I purchased this with my own money. Speaking of which, the suggested retail price of this is 40 bucks. Finding these in the United States is fairly easy, but you do need to pay attention because there are people out there who will take advantage of you and will charge you more than this thing is worth. For 40 bucks, $45, I say yes. I picked this up on Amazon. I paid $42 for it numerous months ago. Today, when I took a look on Amazon, it was $45 plus $20 to ship it. So over 60 bucks, it's not worth it in my opinion. It's a good table, do not get me wrong, but in the end, it's just a small table. So ultimately, you have to decide how much you're willing to pay for this. You can find these on eBay all over the place. Typically, you're gonna pay about 60 to $70 some sellers want to charge as much as 70 bucks plus shipping. At the time of filming though, you could find these on campsaver.com for 36 bucks. That's a good deal. The quality of this, jumping to the review, is absolutely excellent. And that is something that I've discovered with the Soto brand. All in all, they make really good products. In the past, we've taken a look at the Japanese little cassette stove. I love that thing. I think it's cool. It's really, really neat. It's definitely different than most stoves that we have here in the United States. And when it comes to this table, it is different from most tables that we have here in the United States. Soto describes this as an origami stove, and that's because it folds up. Very, very smart. Folding it up, it's very simple. You slide the legs, just like so, and you put it up. When it comes time to open it, boom, just like that. When you put it down on the ground or on another surface, it makes for a good, stable, flat surface to work on. With Susan and I, generally, we use this to cook on. We place our stove on it, we prep on it, we cut up vegetables and meat and whatnot. For everything that we've used it for, it's worked perfectly. I've even used this as a nightstand, so to speak, inside of my tent. Lately, I've been testing out some teepee tents that don't have inners. The ground is wet and muddy, I'll be on a cot, and I have this right next to me. After I got done cooking dinner, wipe it off, I could put my phone here, I could put my keys here, my glasses, whatever I want to on this surface and it keeps everything nice and dry. In other words, you can use this for multiple things. It's a multi-purpose table. So really the limitations are based on you and what you wanna do with it if you decide that you want one of these. The quality is excellent. The design is excellent. When it folds up, it's nice and slim. It's very compact. It's not too heavy. It's easy to open up. It's easy to close. And the storage bag is big enough for the table and a windscreen. Both of these fit inside of this bag, which is something that you need to consider. If you're going to have a stove on this, you may need a taller windscreen, such as this, to go with it. 
That way your stove performs efficiently. The table itself is nice and sturdy and solid. No complaints there. It's not flimsy at all. I mean, it really isn't. Now, when it comes to the cons, this is a pricey little table. But with that being said, if you compare this to other products that are out on the market, it, it, it's right in line. There are tables that are a little bit cheaper. There's tables that are quite a bit more expensive. At the same time, it's very much comparable to what else is out on the market. At the same time, you could say that it is a little bit heavy, 14.1 ounces. In my opinion, this is a luxury item, but it really is a useful luxury item. This is a very simple product. It's a little bit expensive, a little bit heavy, but in my opinion, it's very, very cool. I do like this quite a bit. And this is a product that I'm glad that I purchased. I do like it. It works just as I need it to. It's held up well. Now, anytime that I've done cutting on this, I've always put down like a paper towel to protect it. It is a little bit scuffed up, but it's not bad in the least. Considering how much use that it's seen, it's held up incredibly well. If you take care of it, if you take care of your gear, it will take care of you for a long time. Ultimately, with Soto, this is a Japanese company that I've been very impressed with so far. I'm currently testing out a lantern product from them, which I like a lot. All in all, it's a good little product. I like the design of it. It's pretty, pretty sweet. <laughs> The question becomes, do you need something like this? Make sure to comment down below, share your thoughts about this little table. I'm pretty sure that I've called it a stove a time or two. Whoops. <laughs> I have that cassette stove on my mind at the moment. Somebody just wrote in, they were saying that it was so cool and it really is. And this table is pretty neat as well. But yeah, make sure to comment down below, share your thoughts about this table. What do you all think about the Soto brand? It's a Japanese brand, very popular. They make a ton of different products. Again, if you're interested in one of these, make sure not to get taken when it comes to price. You could pay 40 bucks retail, or you could spend like $90. I suggest 40. If you have any questions about this product or anything else, make sure to email me. I personally go through every single message and reply to every single message. I do that on Facebook and I do that through email. The other methods, I may not even see the messages such as Twitter, I never look, Instagram, I never look, Facebook, email, that's it. But yeah, if you have a question, email me. Until next time, strength and honor. Bye everybody.